know what you should start with video with Sharice Hodges. And I just have to say, I love her books, okay? She's always been an auto buy. Even before Books, Beauty, and Stuff came out, she just always been amazing. I love her style of writing. I like that the women characters get along without any backbiting, calling each other names, calling each other, um, just that the usual stuff you see. I'm not, and I'm not saying for all um, women relationships, but I'm just saying they really, these ladies support each other. And these are the ladies from the, um, Going Family and Friends series. And you also have the ladies, um, the Richardson Sister series uh, that I do love as well too. Um, also MJ and, um, Minnie as well too. Um, the two friends from the, um, trying to think of that series, y'all. Hold on. It's called the Southern Loving series. That was under Harlequin. Um, a lot of her other books, she's written, she's written under Defina. Um, like the Going Friends, uh, Family and Friends series, which I was just discussing also. Um, she's also written the Richardson Sister series, um, the Rumor series. And she has a couple of standalones I like. Um, Forces of Love, um, Tended at Midnight, um, More Than He Can Handle. Um, just to name a few, Too Hot for TV. That was that was definitely one of my favorites. That one and Tim Did at Midnight was definitely two of them were definitely my favorites. Ooh child. And when I say she could write her a na ooh child, she could write her a good nasty love making scene, baby. Woo. How did I discover Sharice? Well, I was walking through borders, minding my business one day, and I saw um more than he could handle. Um, I saw that one and I think it was 2000, maybe it was 2008. Um, and I saw that book and I bought it. I liked her so much that I ended up buying the first book of the Goins Family and Friends series, which is, um, Let's Get It On, uh, featuring Maurice and Kenya. And since then, I've just been hooked. Um, I enjoy a lot of her books. Um, um, Love After War, that's part of the Goings um, family and friends series as well too, but it's kind of a standalone too. It's just mainly featuring um, the Crawford guys and Adrian himself. You have uh, Simon and Richmond who each have their own story of falling in love too. So um, their father was a total jerk by the way. Um, yeah, so I love her books. Like I said, the friendships between the ladies are beautiful. Um, There's a lot of lessons you can learn from there. Um, definitely a lot of um, black womanism or feminism. And it's cool with me because a lot of the, femin the feminism views and some of the political standpoints, I definitely agree a lot with. Um, like I said, there's a lot of friendship, bonding, um, and I think Let's Get It On definitely endeared me to her, especially she had a full, she had a lesbian character who was a minor character. Um, her name was Maya, and I actually liked her. I was like, okay, I like I like this lady. I like her. Um, I felt right there. I'm like, yeah, she's an ally. So, yeah, that definitely endeared me to her. Um, Ken High Love is the latest book from her The Richardson Sister series, and I am definitely will be getting that as well. So, you will have a review on that as well, too. As a matter of fact, I'm going to put the three Richardson sisters review above so you guys didn't, don't miss that and you guys can check that out as well too. Um, yeah, so definitely I will link her website below so you guys can check her books out as well and hope you guys um, just enjoy this video. By the way, the books that she wrote um, from the Southern, the Southern Loving series, I don't know why my son gets so sad. Feel the Heat and um, The Heat Between Us, those are under Harlequin. Um, I know you can probably still, you make a skill to get those paperback, and no, no, no. It, it can get on, you can get it on Kindle, so I will link those below as well too, because I enjoy those um, series with Mimi and um, MJ as well too, so yeah. Um, thank you guys for looking at books, media, and stuff. Thank you guys for checking me out and enjoying, just enjoying, um, my videos and content. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.